Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Guys, we're gonna be using shore fishing at Indian River Inlet. Um, our, my charter boat uh, trip got canceled due to the winds and um, just kind of, you know, hazardous condition. So no worries at all. Um, I have not been at the Indian River in probably over a year or so. So looking forward to it. Picked up some bait, um, nice drive. We're gonna get to them and uh, let's go. Let's see what happens. guys here we are at the spot um just want to let you know what i'm using today i'm using a uh, diable saltis for on one of the setups a shimano saragosa for one of the other setups a uh, tsunami airwave elite um spinning rod and a uh, brand new jigging world shadow surf rod they're both 10 footers mainline 80 pound braid um 60 80 pound mono i'm using a double slide hook um tall rig with three to four ounce um bank sinkers and cannonball sinkers small here yeah. feels good but then <laughs> yeah too small guys um when you fish the inlet be ready to lose some tackle it is just what it is unfortunately and it, it's gotten worse since the last time i have fished there but um i always pre-rig i bring 50 sinkers um another pack of 25 hooks but i pre-rig 50 uh rigs because i know i'm going to be losing tackle there's just no way around it so um here you'll see um how i'm stuck and i'm going to lose it i'm going to snap the line <laughs>
too small. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Let me see if that will work. Hey guys you're gonna see here that um this fish is a keeper you're gonna i'm gonna measure it. it's over 16 inches um i either had a brain fart or something but um i mean i generally go boat fishing a lot and the mate usually measures the fishes and everything and you're gonna see on this measurement <laughs> that it's gonna be over 16 inches i thought i measured it incorrectly i threw it back in the water and happened a couple times today so uh the fish are still swimming in the water Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, guys, anytime I'm out fishing, it's a great time. But what makes it even sweeter is um, if you meet one of your subscribers or a, uh, or someone from a club that you're in, like a fishing club. And that's what happened this day. I met PA Bass Fishing um, and his father as well. Extremely nice, um, um, nice person um, and PA Bass Fishing. And then the other gentleman, I, I'm, so, I'm sorry, I forgot his name. Um, but it's nice to meet others that enjoy the passion um, and... And, you know also follow my channel and you know thank you so much again it was a nice meeting um everyone and i uh, hope you guys like it more to come and um take care guys